MLB The Show's coverage of Major League now, Baseball is on the air. Should be a good conquest matchup today between the Raptors and the White Sox. So striding in, Alex Bregman, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. The third baseman, Alex Bregman. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. Now a swing by Bregman, and the ball hit well to deep left. Gone into the home bullpen for a home run. Standing in now, number 86. Number 86. Oh, and that ball's absolutely crushed down the line. Forget about it. That's going to stay fair and make it back to back home runs. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. As he'll take a look at ball one. Base is empty here with nobody out. Fouled away. And he'll stay alive here as this is chopped foul at the plate. It'll remain one and two. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he's set down for the first out. He's ready. Here's the first offering. High in the air out to center field. Robert will wait on it. And that's out number two. Here's Bryce Harper now. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Ball one, no strike. A ball and a strike. One and one. Guide in the air to straightaway left. Waiting on it is Jimenez. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Tim Anderson. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. And this is Pop fouled off to the right and back into the seats. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Hit high and deep to right center. And that'll hop over the wall out there as he starts the home first with a ground rule double. So here's Juan Moncada, runner in scoring position here already following the ground rule double. And he turns on this one and yanks it foul and back out of play. Swung on and chopped out to the shortstop. Story scoops it up, and there's one down now. Now at the plate, Jose Abreu. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And a sinker misses here. No, a called strike. I take that back. Good pitch there down below the zone. Got him to go after it. In today's game, we're seeing so many guys strike out and not worry about it. I'd love to see a little two-strike approach right here. Maybe shorten up a little bit and try and force speed something the other way. And another foul ball. Anderson, the runner at second with one away. Rip down the first base line. A little bit off the outside. It's one and two. What pitch recognition right there. 90% of the guys are going fishing after that nasty slider. The one two. Pitch number 10 is the one that finally does it as he strikes out after a long battle here. Starts him out with a sinker that's inside. 1-0. A ball and a strike. Two out here and a runner at second. Count is 1-2 and two now. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three. And the inning is over. 
second inning set to go and in to hit next shortstop Trevor Story. Now a swing and a miss as they start him out on a pitch well inside for strike one. Oh I love that pitch right there up and in jam sandwich hit down the third baseline but this will wind up a foul ball strike two. Count remains at 0 and 2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Digging in Gavin Lux. Pitch on the way. And this pitch just about saws him off as he can't get extended at all at strike one. When I broke into the league, not many guys were throwing that elevated fastball with that much velocity on it. The game has changed. Fielded by Abreu, and he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. So bases are empty here with two gone. And up next, the corner outfielder, Mitch Hanniger. And a fastball to start things out here. Not close, it's a ball and no strikes. One and two now. From the windup, the one one pitch. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Hey, I got to really commend this pitcher right here. Was able to regroup in between innings. Something happened in the dugout because he's on point coming out for the second. Two balls and two strikes now. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at three and two. One of the things you want to do with a starter, get that pitch count up. Here's another productive at bat. Oh, a diving effort as it's off his glove. But they'll still manage to get the out on the force. And with that fine play, the inning comes to an end. Last half of the second set to go. And that'll bring up Yasmani Grandal. And that's cut on and missed 0-1. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0-2. Not the ideal location for a changeup up in the zone, but he got away with it. 1-2 to the White Sox catcher. Line toward the gap in left center, and that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. This will kick up against the wall now. In now the power hitting outfielder Nomar Mazzara. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. The 0-1. Hard hit ball to second. Fielded cleanly. Throw to first is in time for the first down. Up next for Chicago, Luis Robert. Here's a sinker to start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. Ball in a strike. Skied into very shallow right. Harper coming on. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. And this would be a tough opportunity to squander this late in the ball game, but he'll hold tight with two away now. Rounded down the third baseline. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Skied into straightaway right. Harper has a read on it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Jeff McNeil will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Hit sharply toward the right side. He dives. Did he catch that? He did. What a play there for the first out. So one away here with the bases empty. And that'll bring up Alex Bregman. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But hey, listen, a home run is a home run. High and deep down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. A 1 1. Scorched to third. 
And a base hit into left field, so they've got themselves a one out base runner. Now back, number 86. At the plate, number 86. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Big swing and a miss at the changeup, a ball and a strike. Hey, you know the pitcher right now, he's looking for that best friend, that double play ball. This is where you have to really be disciplined at the plate and make sure that you get a pitch that's above the knees that you can get in the air. Easy there, big fella. Two and two. That's exactly the pitch you don't want to be chasing in these situations. He's going to keep that ball down below the hollow of the knee, try and get you to ground into a double play. You have to set your sights at least belt high. Sharply hit ball back up the middle, and that'll get down for a base hit. And he is in there. Here's the first baseman, Freddie Freeman, as he'll watch a slider that runs out of the strike zone away for ball one. Looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Swing and a miss. Looked like the slider there, a ball and a strike. The offensive approach here is simple. You know the pitcher's going for the K, so set your sights middle of the plate. And then don't worry about the infielders. They're so close, hard contact is a guaranteed ribby. And this is swung on and missed, so they come right after him, and it remains second and third, but with two away now. Jimmy Cordero comes on now, looking for the final out of the inning to strand the two runners in scoring position. 0-1 the count. Ready with the 0-1. Hit on the ground for Anderson at short. Reined in. And the two out threat will not come to pass as Edwin Encarnacion will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Mariano Rivera is on and he'll take over on the mound in relief. Now pitcher. Mariano Rivera. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. And he looks at a slider in there, one and one. And this is a ball to Encarnacion. Two and one now. The pitch. Three balls and a strike to the Chicago leadoff hitter. It'd be great right here if he was able to work himself on base. You got the leadoff hitter on deck, and you know the middle of the order is coming up right behind him. Fouled off. Another payoff pitch. And good patience exercised as he works out the walk to lead off the home half of the third. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Yeah. Outside target and here, and he hits it for strike one. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Man, you don't see this in today's game that much. The guy who... Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Next to bat will be the Cuban import, Juan Moncada. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Ball and two strikes now. None out, runners at first and second. Struck him out. One out here in the Shy Sox third. And one of the more prolific RBI men in the league the last few years, Jose Abreu, will bat next. Loud contact there, but it's well fouled. He's set. Here comes the one one. Runners are at first and second with one away. And he got him. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Elo Jimenez. Two on, two out for him here in the third. And he fouls this one off. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. This one's outside. Quite a bit off the plate that time. And it's fouled away. The White Sox down to their last strike. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Now another 1-2. Line toward right center. And that's in there. Base hit. Encarnacion rounds the corner and is headed home. 
And this will not be close, and the run will score easily. And he's safe. Ken Giles comes on now, and he's just hoping to keep this thing tied. No save opportunity here. Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal, as he'll swing and miss it, a first pitch slider at strike one. And he pulled up in time, but it's a called strike two. Got to believe you're going to get some tough pitches in this count with the base open at first. This is where you have to regroup and find a way to get a good pitch to drive in that run. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Well, he went for the knockout pitch that time, but a good eye, one and two. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. One two offering looked like a slider that time, but it's two and two. These are the great matchups that happen throughout the course of a game. I don't think as a pitcher you can give in right now. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Jace Fry, the six foot one inch southpaw, will be the one that gets the call from the bullpen here. And Bryce Harper will dig into the plate. Flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. No balls in one strike. One and one. Fry is among a dying breed. Those lefty specialists whose roles are changing with the new rules around reliever usage. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. the letters but called high it's a ball good job to work the count and put himself back in the driver's seat started off with one strike and now he's got to count his favorite three and one and right into the shift scooped up throw to first in time one gone here in the fourth so the base is empty here with one away and in to hit next the power hitting shortstop Trevor Story from the stretch in the air out to center field. Robert is back and he'll get there to make the play for route number two. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Gavin Lux. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Lifted in the air toward the line and right. Headed after it is Mazzara. He can't get there so the inning will continue. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Stepping in now is Mitch Hanniger. Moncada fields it cleanly. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Comes set. The 0 1. And he couldn't get him to chase the 0 2 fastball. It's 1 and 2. This is a huge at bat right here. He wants to get this guy and have the pitcher lead off next inning without question. Now a ball lined to the left side. Swung on and he went fishing in the dirt. Brandall gathers and that ends the inning. Into the box. Nomar Mazzara. He'll step in trying to do something about this 2-2 two -two tie. Line drive to left. And he is going to have extra bases to start it out. And your winning run will be in scoring position. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. Stepping in now, Luis Rubber. Fouled away. Well, this is lined into left center, and it's going to get down out there. And the winning run will score as they walk off with a 3-2 victory. Well, the way things unfolded, you kind of had a sense that this thing was going to end in dramatic fashion, and that's exactly what happened. A walk-off for the win? Wow. In a close game like this, you look for that one guy who produced when it mattered most, and this is the guy. He's our tops player of the game.
He was one of a few guys that really swung the bat well in this game with a pair of base hits. He helped propel his team to a hard-fought win. One-run game this afternoon.